to South America now, and Chile's Atacama is one of the hottest deserts in the world. It is also the one with the highest levels of ultraviolet radiation emitted by the scorching sun. Now Chileans are putting that UV to good use with Latin America's very first thermosolar power plant. It might as well have been put on Mars. This futuristic site is the Cerro Dominador power plant, a $1.4 billion project that has been developed in Chile's Atacama Desert. More than 10,000 collectors follow the sun to reflect radiation onto the top of a tower. 250 meters high, the heat moves through molten salt into water, producing superheated steam to the tune of 210 megawatt, enough to power 380,000 homes in the country. At the opening ceremony, Chilean President Sebastián Piñera spoke of the dawn of a new age. Chile used to be a poor country when it came to energy sources. We had little oil, little coal, little gas, but we are immensely rich when it comes to the energy of the future. We have the desert with the highest radiation in the world, as shown by those white colors seen at the top of the tower, which are reflecting the solar radiation. The Cerro Dominador power plant is able to store solar energy for hours and even through the night unlike traditional solar plants that only generate output when the sun is shining. The plant is expected to fill the energy gap expected when Chile closes some of its coal plants. It's seen as a big step towards making Chile carbon neutral, a goal the country is aiming for by 2050.